hello everyone my name is riya agrawal from class 8 from mona modern english medium school sarangad my topic is separating healthy seeds from damaged ones so let's start the materials required are a glass and a glass of water and some bean seed first we add the water in a glass and some bean seed into water and we wait for 2 minutes Now we will see that how damaged seeds are floating. And the result is with which seeds are floating enough that are damaged ones and which is downside that are healthy seeds. Thank you. Hello friends, my name is Anisha Kishani from class 8. My school name is Mona Modern English Medium School Sarangad. Today we do activity to separate healthy seeds from damaged ones. So let's start. First we need glass of water some grain like kidneys first we put water into a glass then we put the red beans into glass after 2 minutes we can see some grains are floating in water and some still down damage one seed can float in water because they may holes created by insect these are become lighter and float in water or healthy grains are heavier so they can they can steal down in water thank you for listening me good morning ma'am my name is manya tejaswal from class 8 Today my activity topic is separation healthy seeds from damaged ones. Required materials are kidney beans, glass bowl, glass water. Step one: take a bowl and put the water on this bowl and put the kidney beans on the bowl of water. step 2 stir them and leave them then with undisturbed for some time step 3 observe the grain step 4 after some time we can see some seeds flow in the water surface and some seeds down side of the water the flow seeds are damaged and the down side seeds are healthy seeds Thank you ma'am I hope you like this video have a nice day ma'am we ma'am today I am going to bring on from class 8 and today I am going to do an activity so first we we need a uh, empty container some wheat grains and a uh, glass full of water so first we we will pour some water onto an empty container and then we will pour some wheat grains onto it and we will keep it aside and now after some time we will notice that some some wheat grains are floating on water and some are inside the water and some the, the seeds which are floating are damaged and insects are present here and you can see See there is a hole in it. So what the science says about it? The damaged grains will float on the water, and the healthy seeds will settle down at the bottom of the water. And this is only science. This is this is not a magic. And usually people say about it that it's a magic. So thank you. Hello everyone. Here is Jay Patel from Class A, Mona Modern English Medium School, Sarangar. Today my topic is separation of healthy seed from damaged one. So let us start. That we need a glass of water and some seeds. So the the glass of water and we put some seeds in glass of water and rest it for two minutes. 
and after 2 minute we observe that some seeds flow in water and some settle down that the seeds flow in water are damaged one and the seeds that settle down are healthy seeds so thank you hope you like this video hello friends my name is yagir jaiswal and i am from class 8 i am going to glass so i have taken a glass with the water and i am taking a paddy seeds i i have taken a paddy seeds you can see uh, so see the show the activity we have to show the activity settle down uh, the seeds which are floating are damaged seeds and the seeds which are uh, settle down at the uh, settle down and uh, the, the the seeds which are settle down are uh, healthy seeds uh, so that, that's our activity to separate the healthy healthy seeds from damaged ones thanks for watching my name is sai shakran I am reading classes. Today I am doing my science activity to see that uh, good seeds are on the laying bottom and bad seeds are floating on bottom. Let us start. So first uh, uh, you want uh, a glass of water and some seeds in a bowl. Now we put seeds into glass. Let's get. Are laying on down and the bad seeds are floating on water. So we wait for one one minute. Yes, uh, here you can see that the good seeds are laying on the bottom and bad seeds are on top. 